It's magnificent Mother Nature at work is what's happening. Put a dent in the population today. What's up, y'all? Coming at you with another video. We're out here on the pier. A couple of the pier locals. This is Josh. That's Blair. And that's a beautiful, beautiful Spanish mackerel. Are you gonna let that guy go? Are you gonna release that trophy fish? Yeah, I'm gonna release it. Alright, let's get that on footage. Perfect. Perfect. Oh, beautiful. And it might be dead. Who knows? <laughs> but we got a great day little afternoon of pier fishing so stay tuned for the rest of the video thanks for watching oh Ricky <laughs> oh Ricky let me get under you, dude. Come on. You're, you're over my line. I'm well, sorry. I'll tell the fish to swim that way next time. Triggered old man. Caught a fish today. Triggered old man video <laughs> title. Make Can I lip this one right? You want this one too? Yeah. Just throw them in here. I don't know, I like sleep. Get my bottom rod, please. Get my bottom rod, please. Woo! What a specimen. What a specimen. I'm Oh man, that thing is angry. Probably, you spend like one pound of drag. <laughs> Dude, that's what you gotta do. This is called finessing. Oh, oh follower! Oh, 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 it's oh, the runner! Oh, oh, what the hell is happening? We're gonna eat each other. Oh! oh. 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 <laughs> no, 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 no. Please, please. Right, let us swim out. Come on. It's right there. I'm letting Priest pull it for you. <laughs> <laughs> it's like dolphin fishing, but for a man. Go on, dude. Be cool. Watch out. Watch out. Come oh, on, Blair. What the hell's happening? I don't know, oh, dude. I need a live bait. Live shrimp. Bitch, I'm a live shrimp. Alright, just land the Mogan. Holy shit. Your drag's also like one pound. Well, fishing eight pounds. <laughs> 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 you jigged right into the mackerel. <laughs> yeah, hold them up like that. What do you got there, mister? Dude, that's a <laughs> fucking bluefish guy. Are we, in, uh, are we in Montauk right now? Yes, sir. Catching trophies? Yes, sir. Oh! Among our nation. Woo! Second. Look at all these guys. Buddy, they, weren't, they weren't eating at all. One started eating, yeah, really. and then they all did. Beautiful. <laughs> Look at these creatures. <laughs> All of them. I... Blue fish on. All about 
the X trap. <laughs> yeah, dude, there's so many minnows. They like the X trap. Followers. Oh, I think I got two. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Now I only got one. Had two. <laughs> That one's angry. <laughs> Thing's tiny. Oh, he just got a follower. <laughs> <laughs> Watch out. Flip or die. You want these ones? Yeah, yeah. Alright. Bait and switch. Got him. Bait and switch. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Get in the water! Oh, he came off! Get in! <laughs> oh. Uh, do I even have to walk it over? <laughs> what the hell? Oh, God. What in drag pulling action? You got yourself a trophy there, sir. How does it make you feel? Yeah. You've caught the most desired fish on the pier. What are you going to do now? That's the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it. That was a good little insight into kind of what I grew up doing, pier fishing, catching just whatever's around. Like it, I had a lot of fun just catching bluefish and mackerel and trying to avoid everyone just... <laughs> Let me just say when there's bluefish around, all etiquette and all rules go out the window and everyone at the pier just kind of throws in every direction. A lot of the people that don't know what they're doing can't even see the school and they just see you catching fish so they're just throwing willy nilly bottom baits everything and it's a tangled mess. But you know what? I still love it. It's still something that I grew up doing and it kind of reminded me what I was like when I was a kid. So uh, yeah. Um, one little thing you missed right as soon as I got up to the pier the bluefish weren't eating at all. So I'm just, uh, I, in the past I've seen they won't eat when there's a predator around and a lot of times a barracuda will sit in the school. So what I did is I threw a barracuda tube, um, which I've showed you guys in the past, or at the least I think I have. Let me see, right here. Uh, threw this barracuda tube and in the middle of the school and he comes out and hits it. Well, when he hit it, he kind he must have broke off from the school I think and 
he just stopped pressuring the bluefish and the bluefish felt less threatened. And it was like a flip of a switch. Those fish went from not eating anything to just eating everything. So fast forward, maybe five minutes, everyone's catching bluefish and we see the barracuda. I throw one on the wire rod and he destroys the bluefish. It's a good fight. And as soon as I'm getting his head out of the water, hook pulse. Hook was straight and I used too small of a hook and put too much pressure on it. Whatever, you win some, you lose some. So guys, thanks for watching the video. See you in that next one. Later. What if I do? They might. Wouldn't be the first time I was bit by a mackerel. I got bit by a kingfish. That's even worse. He's been bit by a mackerel, but not by a bluefish. Oh, whoa, don't do that, friend. Oh, he got oh. me. Oh, he's fucking got me. <laughs> I don't know what to right. do. Open his mouth. There you go. There you go. <laughs> Right. He just laughs. <laughs> <laughs> it's whatever.